Pierre Philippe here. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use a regular notepad and convert it into an HTML document or a hypertext markup language document, as it's referred to. To begin, simply right click on your desktop, go to New, select Text Document, open it up, and now we can start formatting our text document. So to start off, we're going to tell the document that it's an HTML document. So we're going to use the HTML tag, less than HTML, oops, greater than. That tells it, our, that's going to tell the text pad that it's an HTML document. So, now, once we got that in, we know that we can proceed. Every document has a header, so we'll simply enter a header tag, which is less than, head, greater than. We also know that every document needs a title, so we'll use a title tag, less than, T-I-T, L E title. Now, here's where I'm going to show you a little bit different type of tag. Uh, according to HTML rules, you know, W3 standard, uh, every opening tag needs a closing tag. So, the way that you close a tag is simply by adding the backslash before the tag name, like such. generally could tell a closing tag by this backslash that identifies the closing tag. You have an opening tag, closing tag. I know, well, you're probably getting ready to say, well, how come these two tags aren't closed yet? Well, we'll get to that in a moment. Now, we've already told our document, our text document that this is going to be an HTML document. We started the header, we gave our, a title in our header. Now we can close the header since we have a title established. Simply less than backslash head greater than. Now that closes our header tag. Now we know that our document needs a body which will contain all of our information that's added into the web page. So to get started on the body, you simply enter the body tag, which is less than body, greater than, and every opening tag needs a closing tag, backslash, body, greater, uh, greater than. That closes our body. Now, as it stands, this is an HTML document, here's a header, has a title, and a body. So simply now we just have to close the HTML document which can be done very simply by utilizing the closing tag. And that's pretty much all the code needed to format a text document into an HTML document. And you can see right here HTML means hypertext markup language. Okay? All right. So, now that we got it formatted, let's save it as an HTML document. To do that, you just go to File, Save As, and we're going to call it uh, First Page, dot HTML, and I'll uh, Hang on, I'll zoom in a little bit on this for you. So yeah, well, y'all can see. First page.html. And I'm just gonna save it to our desktop for now. Okay, so we can go ahead and close this. And we can grab our first page since it's converted into an HTML document. Text pad, HTML document. So we really don't need this anymore. 
So now we have our document. And if we double click on it, it should open up a web browser. It's a, showing a blank page because there's no information in it currently. So let's just quickly uh, add a title to our page. Let's do that. To get back to where you can edit this document, just right click on it and go to uh, Open With and Open With Notepad. If you don't have Open With in your menu, just click Open. Well, no, maybe you don't want to do that. <laughs> My bad. Uh, generally, if you don't have op uh, Open With and you click Open, it'll ask you uh, which you want to open it with. But uh, being that it's already, you know, converted to a HTML document, Open will definitely open it, as we can see. Uh, so we can just right click, Open With, and we'll select Notepad. And then we have our code back that we use to format it. See right here. Uh, so now to give our page a title, we just gonna go in between the title tags, and we'll say my first web page, like so. And then we could just simply go to file and save. Now we should be able to open our document again by double clicking and we'll see that we have our title my first web page. Okay, that's it. I uh, hope you enjoyed this short tutorial on how to convert a text document into an HTML document. Um, I hope you join me in on my next tutorial where I will uh, go into further detail and show you actually how to start inputting some information into the web page as this is the first in a short series of how to build your first web page. I thank you for watching.